Dublin have put in a big, big effort at the start of the second half. Now will it be Mayo's turn to dominate, maybe for a 10-minute spell. That is some point, and that one has gone into the back of the net. It's Stephen Cohen who was in there. Conor Callaghan moving across the 20-metre line, this way and that. Now he goes forward, two against him, he's got it. Quick look up at the target, ambitiously kicked in, and why not? Beautiful score. Taking it short now. They've gone short across as far as Fergal Boland, and Boland hits it over the bar. Mayo lead Fergal Boland. Mayo, one goal and 12 points, 15 points, Dublin 14. Yeah, my lady, I can't have an axle horsely and so turns the hard. I can say, put together to get you. So, shut out to get to your own on the hobble on again, Lynch. Sheer the market, you're not being a top burn up into my so I get dirty. Knock more. I can talk to Henish and I get a hole. Marlock, the Dean, a dull stack, say, get Carton across the Tuckalish. They get Paul Cassidy, Creedy, the Rajah, and John Hoyle. Log the Morgan and trust on Homer, talk to go to the hero. Cut to Maharish, Kenny Murphy. August Femmer V near Wadden and Trusta Hinifshe on the Hoshakas and Fen Lashtik, Sugar the Connor Glass. Come in for a shoot talk. Cool fuck to get Connor Glass. Henado Yuk, a good day. No, I don't know. I get here Owen. Delicate pass again. This one finds McNulty. And on they go, Monaghan. La Belle O'Toole will score this time. Gainey gets just enough on that. Here's Graham O'Sullivan. Goal chance here and blasted to the back of the net. Worked on by Joe O'Connor. David Clifford again. Ball inside. Spillane gets involved. Clifford's involved and he's buried it. Tom O'Sullivan. Not to go to, for his hat trick of scores. That one's going to come back in again. McDonnell under pressure and it's over the line. It's Monaghan 1 12. Kerry, 3.15. Both Roscommon and Galway arrived to Dr Hyde Park this afternoon hoping to get their first points in the Allianz National League. With a strong wind in their favour, Dara Craig scored Roscommon's first from play, making it three points to two in the 18th minute. There were three points in it at half-time and Galway continued to eat into the deficit with freeze from the restart before another St. Bridget star, Ben O'Carroll, shown his class with this effort to make it eight points to six. It took the visitors until the 53rd minute to register a score from play. Curfin's Kieran Malloy found himself in attack with acres of space to reduce the gap to two. And Matthew Tierney followed up directly afterwards with a super score 44 metres out, making it nine points to eight. Paul Conroy shortly afterwards with a free for Galway to draw level in what was to be the final score of the game. The full-time score finished nine points apiece. Shane O'Donnell spins away from the challenge. Ushin Gallen is on fire so far. He's going for another one here. Ushin Gallen off the right boot. Kieran Brady, again that route one delivery. Inviting one inside, Cavan have it in there too. Cuevin O'Reilly. Has the shot for accuracy, it's good. Long kick out over the head of virtually everybody in the middle, and Dunny Gold could be through here. This is Jamie Brennan, forced wide. Brennan still looking for the score and gets it picked up again. Is there a score in this for Calvin? This one high from James Smith and over the bar. It's finished. Calvin 12 points, Dunny Gold 13 points. With just over five minutes left to play in the first half, McCosker again played a ball into space. It dropped short and Kildare keeper Donlan somehow dropped the ball into his net to leave it 1-7 to 4 at the break. After the restart, Paddy Woodgate sold a brilliant dummy to give himself some space to hit Kildare's first score from play after 36 minutes. It was five points to 1-7. But in the 61st minute, Shane McGullion found Joe McDade and he slipped it to Casty, who rounded the keeper for an easy finish. It finished for Mana 2-10, Kildare 12 points.